What is up, guys? It's your boy, Nikki with Living Loud Reactions, and we are dropping a great new video for you guys featuring some crazy UFOs and all kinds of creepy-ass shit. Hope you guys are going to enjoy what we have in store for you. I am confident you guys are going to enjoy the content we're about to throw down. So if you haven't had a chance to, guys, be sure smash that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't had a chance to subscribe to our channel yet. And without further ado, just about to get crazy video this morning that some say may be proof we're not alone when the form of a bright light is seen descending over the dome the video is said to be taken over the weekend Bro. Uh, then suddenly the light shoots up into the I've sky i've seen this video before only recently has the government acknowledged the existence of ufos they're right? real but now we know they're under the water they're in space the when steve-o is out there trying to bring awareness to everyone about aliens you know shit's getting crazy. This is documented, so unidentified anomalous phenomena is the new government term. It was in the middle of the night. I just saw this large head. What the hell? Bro, it's I like, started to realize that like the an head alien that I praying saw mantis. It wasn't necessarily <laughs> humanoid looking. Nope. Extraterrestrial sightings that have been made that over shit. several decades Man, aren't what the hell? all limited just to UFOs, Fake. but also to more physical ones. The hell is that? With us that look like, like a stick or a root just desperate for water after being deprived for like three centuries. <laughs> oh, oh. It's on the road that shocked the whole world. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, hell. <laughs> the knock. <laughs> Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Sh sh see that? Everyone's curiosity about Area 51 Telling finally you. proved to be more than just a conspiracy theory. In April 2016, a group of young adults was we keenly go. heading to Area 51. Here we a go. secret U.S. Air Force military installation located at Groom Lake in southern Nevada until they were stopped by a flat tire, where minutes later, an alien figure appeared <laughs> from nowhere crossing the road until they disappeared just as quickly. Bro, is it just me or does that look like the fakest ass costume I've ever seen in my life? God, why would people believe this crap? Seriously, I'm, I'm going to keep it up in mind. Yeah, that's really an alien, let me tell you. Close the trunk. According to them, only one of the group members got to see it. And unfortunately, he also happened to be recording Let's see at if the we can same pause time, this. giving him the... Oh my God, you got to be kidding me, guys. Wow, I can people got to get common sense. How the hell would you believe that? I mean, honestly, does that look like an alien? Seriously, guys, come on, really? You know, those spandexy like costumes, the Spider Man ones that zip up in the back, you know, that you can get different, different types like blue, black, white. Th that's what it is. I mean, that's what it is. It's literally a cosplay, stretchy, stretchy costume. If you believe that's an alien, you're a moron. What'd you do? Buy that off eBay? Evidence to his claim. Where'd it go? Where'd it sh sh See that? Landed UFO. A Canadian tourist was sightseeing the mountain shit. areas of Mexico while on a tour, only to notice a UFO like flying saucer that had landed. Another similar sighting was also shared by construction workers, not too far away from the first one, showing a brightly lit flying object. I mean, that could be anything. Days after the first that could sighting. be anything. Don't get me wrong. I believe in UFOs. If you seriously are one of those people that think we're the only intelligent in the entire universe, you're an idiot. I mean, there's trillions beyond trillions of galaxies and exoplanets and all this other crap you really think all that was made for us i mean are we that egotistical seriously are we that entitled obviously aliens exist it's it's obvious but the thing is, is there's a lot of fake videos out there that you have to shift through because you know people are always just trying to get views so you know a lot of it's going to be fake i'm sorry it is it's going to be fake and when i see the, the bullshit i'm going to call out the bs for when i see it it seems like both these spacecraft were dropping off a load before taking off eventually. Phased out of existence. Phased out of existence. Oh! What the? Holy shit! You may think. Bro, Quantum Leap does exist! Right there! Wow, it's just not a TV show. I'll be damned. I think that you could somewhat predict how a police chase may end up, but this is an outcome that no one could even fathom. You guys remember Quantum happening. Leap? 
How's the guy still sitting in the driver's seat looking straight? You see this big flash. This cop just disappears before your eyes. You're just like, not going to look. Not going to look. Do not want to make eye contact. Do not need a ticket. <laughs> Dashcam footage dating back to the early 2000s shows the moment when a highway patrol in Texas disappeared after pulling over a speeding car. In the clip, you can see within moments after approaching the vehicle, the officer gets a nasty surprise as he suddenly gets laser. If I was in that car and that shit happened, I'd be like, oh, hell to the no. I'd be peeling tired. I'm at my ass would be gone. I would just still be sitting there. With a very bright signature until he shrinks and mostly disappears moments after. As one can't really tell the level of sophistication of extraterrestrial technology and weaponry, the fate of this off- I like how he has the arrow pointing. The arrow pointing, like we don't see where the hell it's at. Officer, <laughs> hangs in the balance. Thank you for that clarification, because I couldn't see the bright ass light on the screen. Abandoned houses, new hey, this, resident. This shit is. Having to find a I saw this in the beginning house, video. This looks creepy. You might expect it to be haunted or a shelter for junkies. Only this one. Or a shelter for junkies. <laughs> that motherfucker said <laughs> it's either abandoned or a shelter for junkies. I mean, he ain't wrong. Was housing an alien? Bro, hell to the knob. Bro, that shit's, that shit's legit, bro. After hearing numerous signs of activity from the area, shortly oh. after they arrived, they Look, noticed right an alien or spirit of some That's kind crazy, was standing dog. by the main entrance and was looking in their direction. That could be could real, bro. Alien phasing out or a type of physical appearance of some ghostly it figure. It could be. It very well could be, guys. Alien. Alien. That's an alien. While expecting a rooftop disturbance to be because of some burglar, this homeowner got the surprise ah, of a lifetime. A villager from a remote location in Indonesia shared this clip after hearing footsteps from on top of his roof in the what? middle of the night. While expecting it to be a rodent or a stray cat, he decided to check it out anyway. What's on my roof? And to his surprise, he came across yeah. this. Yeah. Damn, I'd lose. I would lose my shit if I saw that. An alien figure what? that was keenly I'd looking like, at him for a second. If I saw that, I'd be like, before I'd breaking I'd contact. Motherfucker, you want some cookies? Into the Get out of here. This of the roof. Possible abduction in progress? The real question of concern here is not about if the aliens were actually abducting oh, anyone brother. here, but who could possibly yeah, be their person of interest. Yeah, because that's totally real. Why? A modified Stupid. version of an alien spacecraft was seen flying very close to the ground. With it if you saw a spaceship that damn close, people don't have common sense anymore. If you believe this, again, I'm sorry, but you're a moron. I mean, if you really honestly thought this video was legit and you saw a spaceship in the middle of the neighborhood with that much detail, that low to the ground, don't you think you would see this shit all over CNN, all over Sky News out of Australia, BBC and freaking the UK, Fox News, you'd see it everywhere. You'd see it everywhere. You thought that video of that crap that went viral in Miami got big, remember? Of the supposedly alien with all the cops and stuff. And the alien they showed was like, you could barely even tell what the hell it was. If that could go viral, don't you think this would go massively viral? But no, we have to take the word for it that it's true because we saw it on a couple of videos on YouTube. It's not rocket science, people. Fake video. In the residential area of Glasgow, Scotland. That left everyone concerned, more so when it fired a kind of suction beam onto one of the houses before making a run for it. Yeah, well, that's no not, that's that definitely not CGI. Nope, not CGI. I refuse to believe it's CGI. They have been abducted by it. <laughs> so Flying dumb. saucer in Jerusalem. The video is said to be taken over the weekend. Uh... Perfect example of what I was just talking about, like how that would be all over the news and stuff. This video, when I first saw this video, I was skeptical. I was like, uh... I don't know, man. It's just CGI, you know, just the way it flies up. You'll see in a sec here. But then I saw the same damn video being talked about on ancient aliens. Then I was like, oh, snap. Ancient aliens ain't going to report on UFO videos unless they know that all the fake crap and all that stuff has been eliminated. Because, dude, they've got UFOologists on there that have been doing this for years on ancient aliens. And they've got scientists and everything on that show 
you know, that have been doing this for a long time. They're not just going to talk about some video that's obviously been debunked. Like, this has actually been on the news and everything, like I was talking about. That's my point. Like, if it's legit and real, you're going to hear about it on news networks and actual shows that have credibility. Uh, then suddenly the light shoots up. Those clips have gone viral now. In what is considered yet another sacred region, the emergence of such mystical figures cannot be dismissed this shit is as crazy, anything bro. less than a potential divine manifestation. Look at this. UFO in the form of a bright light is seen descending over the dome of the rock in Jerusalem. It's on the news. In Jerusalem, a man captured an abrupt shift in weather conditions while filming from a rooftop, revealing the fleeting appearance of an angelic silhouette in the sky. Yep. Initially unnoticed by Legit. the court, the peculiar event was only recognized upon later review of the footage, prompting him to share it online in search of explanations. Oh, there it goes. Downtown Miami incident. Oh, that's what I was just talking about. This is what I was talking about. This went viral. Went great you can't even tell what the hell it was. What Stupid. Could be an outright invasion. After this video, have you heard about it lately? You know, the first couple of weeks, all you heard about was this stupid video because why it went viral people are just adding fuel to the fire making it bigger than it was it wasn't no damn alien miami freaking police even did interviews saying everybody calm the hell down it's not a damn alien there was some shooting or something and those are actual people walking stupid people just make things into this huge thing and make it into something it's not and all it takes is something to go viral i don't know if you guys remember like a few years back when that girl was on some talk show and she was like Catch me outside. Catch me outside. That went viral. Like everyone freaked out about it and laughing and everyone's talking about catch me outside. Same thing with this stupid Miami video. It went viral. But now you don't hear shit about it. You don't hear about this video like crazy anymore. Why? Because it died down. It had its moment being viral and now it died down. January 2024, amidst chaos in Miami, police attributed a brawl among teenagers as the cause. Huh. Yet social media erupted with claims of something more otherworldly. An Stupid. unverified video circulating on TikTok and X depicted a purported 10 foot alien walking oh my outside God, a shopping mall. That is the most the deformed ass alien I've ever seen. Focused on police or it's a pixelated camera. I mean, two people walking. I mean, that's my opinion. Responding to the teenage altercation on New Year's Day, the video went viral with false. Are you really shocked to see that much police in Miami? It's Miami. Outside, despite law enforcement's explanation, speculation and intrigue persisted online regarding the mysterious incident. Walking xenomorph. Of all kinds of aliens that you may have seen or heard of, this is the one that could be what the, the hell most. What the that? After hearing a loud, oh, high-pitched oh, screeching no. voice, a homeowner discovered Bruh. this huge alien that was casually... Wow, that ain't no alien, bro. That's the afterbirth of a rhino who borderline had a miscarriage. I mean, what the hell is that thing? Front lawn. Judging from its large head and long tail, it looks to have the closest resemblance to that of the xenomorph alien species okay. that we saw in the alien movies. If this is actually the case, then within a matter of days, these aliens could easily multiply and take over the human race. Skimpy Walker. Skimpy Walker. Creeping. This is rather some troubled being of the supernatural than an actual alien walking the streets. A security camera in Kentucky that's in recorded this clip showing a humanoid-like skimpy figure that was walking by the streets in a Creepy. manner that made it seem almost worrisome. At one point, it was thought to be a robber trying to sneak into a house. I don't think it's a robber. I th think that's a Canadian crackhead in a desperate need for a tan. To another, where its nature was thought to be of an extra-dimensional being. If you happen to know more about this footage and the walker, do share it with us okay. in the comments. Share it. Piercing out anomaly. Though this hunter wasn't expecting to come across a being from outer space, at least he was prepared to defend himself. A father and son duo were heading out hunting for a buck until a buck, their huh? paths crossed with a partially alive that? anomaly. It looks to be injured, but the perpetrator is not known while it was wow. asking for assistance, being first discovered by <laughs> Did he just say Did he just say it was asking for assistance? Could you imagine walking in the forest, you're just minding your own business, all of a sudden you walk up on homeless crackhead Groot? <laughs> I am Groot. I need assistance, please. I haven't had water in 20 centuries. It's like a dying Groot root. By the end of the clip, another similar looking anomaly Holy shit. alien appeared. Bro, it's a prop from Star Wars. That's awesome.
Works was not only full of life, but also like he bought it off eBay or Amazon as well. Rooftop Ooh. creature. Damn. Although this figure looks quite like a baby, but most definitely couldn't be one. Oh. How the hell does that? Does that look like a baby? What the hell kind of baby do you have on a roof? <laughs> I mean, if that looks like a baby, I don't want to see this guy's kids. I'm sorry. Homeowner in San Diego Good shared God. this clip during an early morning sunrise, showing what looks to be a kind of creature that we damn usually bro, only that is a straight creepy movies. ass creature alien type. That it appeared to be making an effort to dig its way into the house from the rooftop. Wow, look at its legs, guys! It first attempted to hide itself until it seemed to jump away wow. and disappeared, leaving oh, shit. the obvious questions: if this could have been some alien, yep. a weird creature, definitely, or perhaps a possessed baby of some kind. I God, what is this with this guy and fucking babies, man? Like, that is not a baby, okay? My God, dude. Somebody called DHS on this guy? Descending I mean, seriously. Spacecraft. Just to keep the hopium in check, this could have been anything from aliens attempting to make contact with humankind or their first move towards hostility. Damn. A homeowner in Argentina shared this video of what he claimed to be a UFO that was attempting to make a landing at the nearby airport's runway. In the clip, it could be seen positioning itself for the final descent towards oh. the runway. Now, this could be either because the aliens were actually using a formal approach to land their craft and yeah. join hands with Grace, or possibly to trick everyone gathered by unleashing their complete since when do you know aliens come to Earth because they're in hopes that we all gather around in grace? <laughs> Stupid. Kumbaya. Okay. Force. Hovering Jesus or alien? Probably not Jesus. Airplanes nearby. There's no way this could be anyone with a jetpack or perhaps even not a Iron Man like suit. In June 2019, a Californian man claimed to have witnessed oh, an shit. apparition I've seen these before. resembling these Jesus videos. Christ in the sky. That's crazy, guys. Residence. Just floating, yeah. man. Accompanied by his you imagine seeing that in the sky, guys? Outdoors, observed a peculiar object hovering in the sky. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, guys. Like this, this right here, bro, seems legit. Have you guys seen these videos of these like humanoid like things flying and just floating in the sky, levitating and stuff? That is crazy, bro. That could literally be an alien, if you think about it. I mean, these these aliens are millions of years more advanced than we are. This this intelligent life. Who knows what they're capable of? That could be supernatural. It could be an alien. It could be anything. I believe in this. And not only that, but I don't think it's CGI. Because if you look at the video, you see how pixelated it is? You could tell the guy is like filming something in the distance. Probably with his cell phone or something. But I believe this is legit. I think this is... I don't know what this is, but it's creepy as hell. I know that. <laughs> Definitely creepy as hell. Now that I look at it, it could be a piece of turd just floating. Left astonished as it bore a striking resemblance to a floating figure. The entity gracefully Damn. glided through the air before descending towards the ground. It's got, as bro, it look at that. It's got a cape and shit on, dude. It looks like the Grim Reaper. God, if I saw that in the sky, oh my God. Please, Lord, I swear to God, please, 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 just, just please don't let me lose my life. I know I said it a thousand times, I'll never do this again, but I swear to God, this time I'm telling the truth, I'll never do it again. Landing. The man captured footage of the mysterious occurrence and dismissed suggestions of balloons or drones, citing proximity to an airport where such objects were prohibited. Stalking alliant. Stalking a of all damn. The stalkers out there. Imagine having, having an alien, alien stalk your ass. To be by far the Bro, worst. look at that thing. A group of kids were. Could you imagine having an alien stalk you? <laughs> like seriously, it's bad enough humans stalk you, but I mean, I, how do you react? To, how do you have a an alien stalking you? That's a whole nother level of freaking restraining order. What do you tell? What do you tell a judge? Like you go to court, you're like, um, judge, um. So I've got this alien stalking me, and I don't... Sir, 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 they're not aliens, okay? They're undocumented. We don't call them aliens anymore, okay? They're newcomers. <laughs> so I'm not talking about an illegal alien. I'm talking about a real alien from space. It's following me everywhere, texting me and shit, and showing up at my work. Playing in a small village by the wilderness somewhere in Brazil, when the recording camera of a guardian unknowingly recorded an alien like figure that was hiding by the tree line not Damn. too far from them. It wasn't until it doesn't the look footage like it's was hiding. reviewed, which is when it was actually wow. spotted. Look at that thing, dude. 
That looks like, uh, that is like the proudest looking alien I've ever seen. He's got like his chest out. He's all like this. He's like, this is what he's doing. He's like, just bam, start it with your chest. Shortly after, the alien disappeared, leaving the reason and its person of interest both as unknown. Oh, there's another one. Behind the bushes. Bushes. A researcher for aliens who, after spending That's several real. years studying that is the not a movie. sightings, was alone in a remote location out of the city when he noticed he was being followed. Judging by the glowing Bro, eyes, he that's initially creepy. thought it to be some wild Not animal the in the bushes. <laughs> Until the other he got a closer look at its face with a night vision Damn. camera. Damn! He'd had a small and slim face. What do you think that is? similar to the kind of aliens usually depicted on the internet. One can only Bro. assume what its that's intentions were. That's probably really an alien. because it didn't like the recorder studying about like, its kind. It's a fire in the bushes and stuff. He has to close. zoom in close just to see it. So that's probably legit. Recorded abduction in progress. Damn. It's not just the alien spaceship that does the abduction. Sometimes it also gets oh, done. Oh, it's alien person. grasshoppers. This footage of an African farmer was shared by his search party after he was reported missing. Oh Initially, shit! He was thought to have been captured by some malicious. Until the very nature of the footage, where the missing farmer was seen God, attempting poor guy. to run God. away while partially revealing the chaser to be a kind oh, of alien. Oh, snap! Either nope. this was a case of taking out all the witnesses, or just that these aliens Damn. might be curious about I think his that, farming I think practices. that creature's got jungle fever. <laughs> run, homie! I got you! Run! 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 Yeah, it might be scared as hell, too. Hiking extraterrestrials. <laughs> In January 2024, captivating footage emerged showcasing... Look at that, bro. If that is an alien, the, the alien's actually like a tourist to Earth. You can tell he looks like he's taking pictures of everything. He's like, oh, wow. Humanoid figures in Brazil intensifying assertion... Look at that body, man. You cannot tell me that's not an alien. Look how it's standing, bro. The body's creepy looking. ...of 10-foot aliens on Ia do Mel Island. Witnesses reported spotting these enigmatic beings atop a hill. Probably just a human, but and surveying the surrounding knows? terrain. The videographer emphasized their remarkable stature and the remote, inaccessible. Have you guys seen these new videos that have been out lately of like these giants standing on top of mountains? They've been coming out a lot lately. I don't know if it's a viral thing again, but like, I don't know. I believe in giants. I do. And it's creepy, too, because these videos that are coming out showing these giants and aliens on top of mountains just staring and stuff. The people that are filming it, you can hear these people in the background reacting to it. And there's multiple people freaking out. So it just adds credibility to the video because you've got multiple people like, oh, my God, look, 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 what is that? The location of the sighting. While speculation also arose about a tall, gray creature, the Brazilian government has opted to tackle the incident through social media, seeking to mitigate its significance. Deceased alien. In the small town of Warina, Bolivia, a man Warina? stumbled upon a peculiar entity near a sewage canal, perplexed by oh the sight, God. as it was unlike anything he'd encountered Why would before. You he That's an alien, the mysterious really? creature and shared it on social media, <laughs> seeking answers. Soon, locals oh claim my sightings God. of a UFO in the Bolivian sky, linking it to the strange... This is so dumb. Why would you post this video? On your channel you're just making yourself lose credibility come on do you really think that's an alien look at that damn thing it looks so freaking ridiculous it's probably like some little alien charm that broke off someone's necklace i could probably make that with pigeon poop carcass dubbed as an extraterrestrial oh. being the lifeless alien suddenly vanished from its original spot sparking speculation Fake. A straightforward explanation emerged, leaving the curious disappearance. Oh, interviewing people in over that. Potential invasion in the works? Let me know in the comments. Either these aliens ran out of their rations, or that they were just tired of watching and reporting. In August 2023, an isolated community in Peru was reported to have been attempting to abduct them, and even attempting to Damn, feed what? off of them in some cases. The awful? aliens were said to be seven feet long, with large faces, and were seen attempting to abduct a 15-year-old teenager. As the locals intervened, they started eating the faces of some of what? them. What? The matter blew up to the extent that a full-blown investigation was conducted by- Aliens eating faces? Really? I think these people were on drugs. <laughs> it's called acid. By the authorities. 
Interrupted cryptid. Interrupted cryptid, While passing guys. Through a bridge in a forest, the chances of coming across any wild animal may be high until you encounter something far uh -oh. different. A lone hunter while passing through a forest in Arkansas was exercising caution by looking around for any potential predators sneaking up on him before he crossed a bridge and his eyes got a hold of what How often are you in the woods crossing a bridge and your main concern is all these animals that are going to creep up on you? You know what I mean? Like were you at the damn zoo? Looked to be a tiny cryptid that was interrupted by the encounter. Oh, it's a little while alien. It was collecting firewood. With the footage abruptly getting cut oh, off in cold. between no one knows for sure what followed next. Bro, that 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 could low be an alien, bro. Saucer. The fact that it's flying too low shows that this isn't another case of a flying saucer jumping through space, rather plotting an adventure. A motion sensor camera at a military munitions storage I don't know warehouse if that's UFO. in China I don't know. started recording when this huge flying saucer made a low altitude flyby, seemingly gathering intel. Until the footage it looks was reviewed, like a no piece one realized like the development until the footage was seen showing how it was in the easily sky. able to dodge all radars within the proximity. I don't know about that one. Let me know in the comments if you think, whether you think that is. Seeing Lurking this shadow. Should tell you that forests can sometimes be as scary during the day oh, as in shit. night. This recording that made its way to the internet shows a lone explorer in the forest that was being consistently surveyed Damn, I can see it and followed by a visible shadow Whoa. of an unknown nature. I would be As gone. the was looking Look around at that, dude. suspicion, the shadow can be seen quickly Look trying that. to hide itself behind a tree. Oh, Seems like even the shadow <laughs> oh, demon didn't God. realize what to do. Freaky so ass, bro, which are known to run away on such an occasion as that. That's a oh, it's a Blair Witchy shit. Top oh hell no! Seeing both these figures, you'd be convinced that these are actual human beings. But the source of they the are campers in Portugal shared this clip, saying that these looks like a movie scene from the Karate the Kid. Ease on top of a mountain <laughs> that was covered with dense Box forest. Box off. Also, these <laughs> figures were far bigger than any normal-sized human. Even oh my God, you're dumb! They're normal, normal, regular, standing they seem people. They to be either locked in some kind of a friendly duel. Or actually hashing out their personal differences. Uh, that was our first actual video reaction video that we finally have dropped, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. We're gonna have a lot more videos coming, and just keep in mind our videos are gonna get a lot better as we grow and as we learn more. And so we're gonna be reacting to all kinds of videos from more UFO videos, paranormal videos, Bigfoot, Antarctica, all kinds of crazy different videos. If you have any ideas or any videos you'd like to see us react to, let us know. You can also send us clips of stuff you'd like us to react to as well to livinloudreactions at gmail.com. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't had a chance to yet, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Smash that like button. Drop your comments below so when we post a new video, you'll be the first to know. My name's Nikki. This is Living Loud Reactions. Thanks for watching, and until the next video, much love and react loud.